Okay, so let's draw a diagram for this one. We've got a sphere. The sphere is at 27 degrees C and the surrounds are at 77 degrees C. The surface area of the sphere is given by 4 pi r squared. So that's 4 pi times 0 0.5 squared. These will cancel and so the surface area is pi. Okay, so part A asks us what's the rate of energy transmit emission. So, so the power emitted is equal to sigma a e t to the 4. So this is sigma is 5.6696 times 10 to the minus 8 times the surface area times the emissivity, which we're told was 0 0.85 times the temperature to the power of 4. So that's 27 plus 273 or to the power of 4. Solving that on the calculator, we get 1,226, which is 1,230 watts, just to three significant figures. Okay, part B, we were asked what was the rate of energy absorption. So this is equal to sigma A E T naught to the 4, so the temperature of the surrounds to the power of 4. So same numbers, 5.6696 times 10 to the minus 8 times the surface area, times 0 0.85, times, in this case, 77 plus 273 to the power of 4. Solving that on the calculator, we end up with 272. So, sorry, 2,272. So, 2,270 watts. Okay, finally, we're asked for what is the total energy transfer. So, P total you can see it's absorbing more than it's emitting, but we just do the difference between these two. So that is equal to 1,040 watts.